for joining us on Through the Smart Way. This is Jen. And if there's anything you've learned from me in my videos this year, it's been that Jen likes to be prepared. I don't like to be surprised by stuff. Um, I just like to be prepared for everything. So it's no surprise that I'm starting my holiday shopping and my holiday state of mind a little bit earlier. And let's face it, we all want to be done and over 2020. So the quicker we can get to New Year's and through Christmas, the better all around. One tip I have for you guys is start early. In my family, we do stockings. And unfortunately, I bought these huge stockings that I love. They're furry, they're amazing, and they're huge. Um, so it takes a lot to stuff them. So what I do is I start early just go to think about things that you need um i have a friend that's never that never did stockings growing up and so she was like what do you put in stockings think about things that you need things that you would have to buy anyway but it would be nice to already have them stockpiled um in my household and up and through college and up and i'm still i'm an adult i still get a stocking until i got married i got one from my parents or from santa claus sorry um <laughs> so yeah start early looking for things things that you need um electronic or electric toothbrushes um a neat smelling deodorant bath and body works trial size lotions and um balms and things of that nature nail polishes for girls um like i have little ones and i have little boys now so the toothbrushes are always a good big hit because i'll get the themed ones and they know you know every three months we replace that one with a new one um so get things that they need the things that they would have to get anyway they would have to get crayons for the start of the school year um they Need, they want coloring books, activity books. Go ahead and like start looking for those things or keeping an eye out for those things. For my husband, keep in mind um, adult items like screen protectors for your phone, charging cables. Who doesn't love a 10 foot Apple Android charging cable? Who doesn't love that? Who doesn't need that? I would never turn that down in a million years. <laughs> <laughs> I love those external battery packs for your phones. Those are also amazing for adults. So just think about things that you would need. Um, I try to keep the price point for each item below $5 because if you are buying over $5, it really, you can have a $100, $200 stocking before you know it. Um, my husband's also put things like magazines uh, my favorite topic type ma magazines in my stocking, like a photography magazine and things like that. So it doesn't always have to be, sometimes it can be just a current event type thing. Sometimes it can be something that you'll use throughout the year, but just keep in mind like things that you would need anyway. The body splashes, the shower gels, um, the shaving kits, the shave or the the razor refills, things like that. Um, the bath and body aisle are kind of places that I usually get a lot of my stuff from. Um, keep in, I also use Victoria's Secrets, uh, Victoria's Secrets semi-annual sale is a great place to get stuff. Um, little makeup bags. Um, so just keep an eye out for those things. And then you'll hopefully have a bag full of stuff in your closet that's hidden out of sight from everyone else that you can stuff stocking with. Um, and then you're ready and prepared for that. So that's my number one tip for getting ready for Christmas is to go ahead and get those uh, stocking stuffers out of the way. All right, I will list some things that are good ideas <laughs> here, no matter if you're shopping for children or for parents or other adults and friends. So thanks again for joining us and we look forward to seeing you soon on Through the Smart Way. Have a great day.